Marco. I play Sorece Karma in a United Kingdom. It's a very powerful, true story. Mr. Karma, I hear your tribe are rebelling against you bringing a white queen home, according to South Africa this morning. Susan Williams' book, Color Bar, was my primary source of information. All I did was look at the picture of Sorece and Ruth on that cover and just knew I had to know more, I had to experience these people, and just knew that we had to make this film. David called me up one evening and said, I've got this script. I hadn't heard of Sorece Karma. I hadn't heard of Ruth Williams before. And for me, one of the things that hit me was the fact that it was a story of African independence. And that fascinated me because I'm the child of African parents who were raised in a colony and saw it become independent. If you choose to marry the leader of an African nation, you will be responsible for the downfall of the British Empire in Africa. The amazing thing about Sorezzi and Ruth's story is that even though there is a political element to it, the bulk of what we're truly discussing here is the power of love. It's a love story that tests social and political waters in the 40s and is provocative still today because of what they stood for. Who do you think will accept you and let him go? We've misjudged this, haven't we? And for me, Sorezze was in service to his people, and the fact that he fell in love with an outsider made him possibly go even further to prove his connection with his own people. I am ready to serve you because I love my people! This story means so much to both of us. I didn't grow up with African leaders around me, but I grew up with African men of dignity around me and of intellect. So in seeing David play this role, it speaks very much to my heart. To be directed by Hama Asante is to be directed by a kindred spirit. She just got it. I think the reason why you should make any period drama is that oftentimes they show us how far we've come, but also how far we still have to go. I think that's really important. I can't do this alone anymore. Then find your way back to me.